Storm clouds. Storm warning just came again. Emergency alert. Flash flood warning. Thunderstorm warning. Independence Day. He said. He said it could be from Independence Day. Uh, <laughs> I couldn't hear. <laughs> Holy smokes. We're under a tornado warning, y'all, for real. Tornado warning. Fun we had. Yeah. District of Columbia. Yeah, they. I would really like to put right here. It's going to be over here for. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. You see all that, right, David? You see the low clouds over there? Yeah. Oh, there it is. Kyle, look. Right there. Wow, David, you were right. I saw it. I turned my camera and saw it. I saw that what you were talking about. Oh, does he get worried? My kids like it. I have weirdo 
have kids, they take after me. But whoa. I don't know, we haven't been in a lot of these situations. But it hasn't even started raining just yet. It's been about five minutes. Yeah. Yeah. Don't worry, Kristen. Okay. He's, he's, like, okay? he's doing great. I thought he was late. Yeah, no, he's no, he's well, hey, he's like the thing is, even though it's different for each day. Well, I'm gonna fly. It's not the here. The thing is, even though it's different for each day, you have to have faith in it. All right, guys, so we are on top of a bus and an actual tornado warning. They just told us to take cover and we're getting off the bus. Where's the stroller? Mom, it doesn't look anything like it. on you just in case, okay? I just don't want to deal with you, Thank you getting all wet and crying, okay? <clears throat> okay, the tornado sirens are going off. Yes, see it. I see it. Um, okay. Well, all the tables and chairs took off a minute ago. Okay, though. Sophie, Grayson, you guys okay? I don't know. I don't know where we'd go. All the shops are closed. <laughs> I mean, this is not the safest place during a tornado. No. <laughs> I was so scared that you and then like everyone was going to just fall down. And Kristen, my contacts didn't fall out, but it got so windy all of a sudden, I couldn't see. I was like, what's happening? I know you brought your glasses. David, I got these. Kristen, what's funny is I thought something got in my eye. Emergency alert. Hey Kyle, I'm gonna check to see really quick. Do you film for a second? Well, I'm waiting until T picks this out. David, you can just walk towards David just said, did you borrow someone's glasses? I was like, how do you borrow someone's glasses? You there, your glasses, give them to me. Leave it to us to find a storm. Get your shirt all wet. Get your shirt all wet. Get your shirt all wet. Yeah, babe, the, babe, there ain't no way you can get this shirt no wetter. I was worried about getting wet. I was worried about Yeah, man, that, that, that well, storm came in. That storm came and just started slapping me in the face again. I was like, oh. I couldn't see anything for a minute. Kristen's like, I lost the contact. I mean, I didn't oh, wow. know what was going on. You lost the contact? That's pretty strong. Both my contacts. Yeah, her contacts got pulled out of her eyes. Uh, One yeah. one side of her eye got pulled out of the left side of my eye. It was kind of like a little bit of 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 a
but they don't give they don't give any tell me about the rain what happened and then what happened Elizabeth, Elizabeth, tell me what happened. Did it rain? Yeah. Tell me about the rain. Oh yeah? It was everywhere? And you had to run down the stairs in the rain? Did, did, oh, you went down the stairs real slow? Walked? Maybe in a few minutes if it lightens up a little. All right, Sophie. Tell me what happened. Give me the replay. Right. Are you happy about that? Oh man, you guys are right under this wind. What are you doing in this air conditioner that's actually working on the bus at the worst possible time? So Grayson, you summoned the tornado gods right on top of our bus at the worst possible time. What do you have to say for yourself? I got another tornado fan. I'm never giving you a water bottle again. You shook it up. The tornado was there. And then... In the old days, we would just sacrifice you for that kind of omen. Just to make sure it didn't happen again. We would sacrifice you just to make sure it didn't happen again. I have a poncho in my pocket. It didn't do me. It didn't because well, I was still putting on Elizabeth's when the water hit me. And guess what? Once you're wet, poncho doesn't help. Damage is done. Cancel it. People are like, you ready? Watch out. This way, guys. 
guys. Hold on, Daddy's getting the best walking disc path. Holy smokes. Okay, guys, there's a step down and everything is wet. We're fine. Audrey Bear, honey, mommy. Audrey Bear, please be careful, sweetheart. <coughs> Excuse me. Single file. Hey, Landon, buddy, stay right behind Aunt Courtney. Follow me. Thank you, buddy. Good job. And watch your step. Libby, you're doing great. Look at you. You're not even complaining. I'm so proud of you. Good job, Landon. I do see. Y'all, leave it to us to get stuck on a double-decker bus in a tornado on vacation in D.C. And now we're walking outside because the bus had to go. We're walking outside in a tornado warning at nighttime with five children, including a three-year-old. The oldest kid's 12 and he's autistic doing great he's like super like totally cool with all this Woo! okay all right now come back we're good libby all right we just had to walk over deep holes oh libby bell you are doing great yeah there's no more holes we're okay yeah we're just walking up on a bridge, you know, freeway, it's fine, with kids, and a tornado storm. I can't stress this to y'all enough. It's totally fine. <laughs> what the heck? What is this even? Oh, lordy. Okay. Well, this is memorable. That's, that's the positive side. We won't forget this. Huh, Libby? We won't forget it. I know. Okay, ready? Here's another hole. Ready? Come around it. my watch. 
Oh, there we go. Tornado warning extended. Sorry, David. I, had, I didn't have my watch in water mode and I don't want it to... Uh-oh, which way did they go? Oh, thank gosh you saw. I did put my... Whoa, okay. I did put my watch in water mode. Don't worry, buddy. We're doing great. We'll just have a story to tell. It's okay, Libby. You're doing great. Look at that little Libby. She's doing so good. Landon's doing so awesome too, buddy. I'm proud of you guys. I don't know, sweetie. We're almost home. Hey, he said go this way. We're gonna go across. Ready? It's okay, we'll just dry our shoes out. David, everyone's looking at us with our family and they're like, they're a poor couple. They're little kids. But it's okay, because we're almost to the hotel. Right, this way. There's the wharf. There's Mavita. We're almost back. We made it. Yeah. Thank you. So great. Hey, Kristen. It's so great. It's so great. So great. I've never lost my contacts in something like it, you know. If there's any dry scratch. Hey guys, hey, wait for mama. All right, come on, let's keep going. Oh, wait, Audrey. Thanks, Audrey. I mean, this is just so great. This is my favorite, you know. I mean, except in Disney World, we had he had on a rain jacket, two ponchos. <laughs> He's been awesome, by the way, Kristen. He was in the game. He's like, oh, there's a mention bag on the way. Oh man. Well, good thing our phones are like. All right, wait, wait, wait. Hey. Uh, I don't think you should go in there like that. I mean, they can't stop me. I mean, yeah, if you want to get me, well, we'll just order. Well, I mean, like food. I mean, or you just order, right? I mean, I mean, if you, I don't know, dude, I don't know. I was just saying, let's find a place. Yeah. Yeah. Mom, I don't find out where we go. Yeah, that's what. Oh my gosh. Holy hell. Excuse my language. <laughs> yep, everyone's looking at us. Yeah, we're the ones who got caught out in it. That's us. Because <laughs> of course we did. Yep. I don't even have words anymore.
So Kristen literally had her contacts blown out of her eyes because we were still on the top of the bus that's, I've never, when the wind came. That's never happened before. That was and like so I was like trying to help the kids not. We were we were yelling. We were yelling because we were freaked out because of the tornado. We were freaked out because the kids had to go down these narrow stairs and it was raining. And, we and then I couldn't see. see and I was trying to help Audrey and she and I are both uh, ready. So we're back. So great. All right, dude. How was that? Grayson called it at the start of the trip. He I said so tornado. Guys, don't slip. I summoned the tornado. I'm, I'm close to certain. Do you have extra contacts? Oh, thank God. I don't ever bring mine with me, and you know how blind I am. I rarely do. Usually I'll just carry a contact case that has solution in it. Big shower. You okay? Let's go, guys. Let's go, everybody out. So we, you remember that episode of The Simpsons where like they're filming the movie and they give him the safety goggles and oh. he's like, my eyes, the goggles do nothing. That was like the ponchos. They did not do enough. We're squeaky. Sophie and I's matching shoes are squeaky. In the museum, they kept catching on my feet and making a noise. And it's Libby, do you want to come back mom, with us? Mom, mom, mom. mom. So we got to see the whole night tour. So, I mean. <laughs> oh my gosh, those are so grossly dirty, Audrey. They're too, guys, we gotta go put everything in the shower. Look at all that we're getting. All right, so Kyle's gonna. This is my recollection of it. I said, this is what it felt like to me to be in the storm that we were just in. I felt like it was like, if you've ever been to Universal Studios in Hollywood, I think maybe it was in Florida too, but it was definitely in Hollywood. They used to have the old movie tour where they would take you like through King Kong, but one of the things they would stop you on was that, that a fake effects of earthquake, they would pretend you're in the subway when the earthquake happens. And you're just standing there, if you've ever been on the ride, you literally just stand there and all of a sudden, they, you know, they fake shake the room and like within about 30 seconds, like it's chaos, there's water spraying everywhere, there's a fire that explodes. I mean, it's, you know, it's designed to, like, excite you, but it happens so fast. You're just like, oh, 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 oh. that's what this was like. Because we were literally standing there waiting for the thing to go off. The tiles are there. Then it starts to rain. Then it really starts to rain. Then the rain's whipping. Then the chairs are flipping over in the streets. And then the girls in Landon was screaming. Everybody was just screaming high-pitched. And, and all the people, people who, on the bus were screaming. All the people who were trying to orderly go down the stairs, all of a sudden, were just like, like Panic. Panicking. And, and everyone was like, don't fall. Don't fall. And just like, it was just, it was just out of nowhere. It was just like in 30 seconds. It went it really just, quick. It was chaos. So. One thing Grayson was pointing out is there was no tornado watch. It like literally went from like, 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 like they were like, there's a bad thunderstorm. What's funny, so we're on this tour. And it's supposed to be a night tour, but it's summer. So we were all joking that like, meh, it's not nighttime. But then it started to get like 
super black dark. Like, I was filming it, and as usual when you're filming these things, with like, I, even on my G7X Mark III, like, it just looks lighter than it does in real life. So, it looked like dark purple black. And it was not nighttime. It wasn't like it was just getting dark. It was like very obviously a big storm was coming. Woo! So then our bus, we were almost to our bus stop and we were like, okay, okay, are we gonna walk it? Are we gonna call an Uber? Like, what are we gonna do? We we're discussing this. And the lady had to like go and do a loop to come back to circle around to like park at the place where the bus was supposed to stop. And so right, like it just starts looking really bad. But it's like not raining or anything yet, but it's just looking bad. So I'm thinking we have some time. We have like, you know, we got 20 minutes to get back to the hotel, which is all we need. And so then we are like doing the little circle thing. And all of a sudden, everybody's alarms start going off. Oh, the other way back, yeah. The alarm. Did well, yeah, you hear the real tornado alarm? They no. must have a real, like no. I heard it going off. No, like as we were turning the corner, like my phone buzzed. And my phone just buzzes for alarms because I have to just kind of set that way. So it buzzes, but then throughout the bus, all of a sudden you just hear that. Like everybody's things are like going off and. As we're driving in, it's like. And so it's like because, the bus itself is a warning. Yeah, well, else. and because we've been getting these like severe thunderstorm warnings, we knew, and we could see it. We knew it was coming. We'd already been getting those alarms going off. So when this one came in, I, I guess I was just expecting it to be that, and I glanced down, and it's like tornado take cover now and then in the distance I can hear like Wee! that was like not our phones and I was like is that a siren and like <laughs> we were on the bus so the lady pulls into the spot so we're like okay everybody go down quick and at that moment for a second before the rain just like plummeted us I still thought that maybe we could catch a cat but then all of a sudden I mean it, when I say all of a sudden I mean literally all of a sudden it just, the sky the, I mean, it just started to pour, and the uh, it, the wind went crazy. And I looked to my left, and on the street level were all these like you know metal tables and chairs, and all of them like just picked up and just blew. And I was like, and at that moment, I felt that same wind on my back, and I was like, what's happening? And then like we were trying to turn, and like that's why Kristen's contacts got like ripped out of her eyes, and like it was messed up. And we couldn't really get off the bus. And so anyway, and then like I said in the background, I was like, is that a siren? Because you could just hear like that. And I was like, and then our things kept, it was crazy. It was crazy. Leave it to us for that to happen. For real. <laughs>